I love this community. So I have been whining, or maybe it's whinging where you're from, about the injuries in FM18. I actually like the changes from like the the little like the bruised ankle one to three days in training type deal. I think that that's realistic makes total sense. Um, but here's why I love the community because you're like you said you love the community. Now you're talking about injuries. So Max Zidane in the comments on episode five said Sunderland at no point had less than seven injured players at any one point or at any one time during last season, many of which were long term. That's the main part of what I want to tell you. So let's let's look here <laughs> inside the game. Let's just look at the squad. Um, right. I know. Let's go. Let's go. Medical center. There's a medical center. We could you know look at that injury history. Okay, two months. Duncan Watmore. Hey, so Max comment got me thinking. I was like, okay, well maybe maybe that is realistic. It's just like in in the the saves I did with FM17. I didn't run into it. I, I, at least I didn't feel like I ran into like an onslaught of injuries when I took over a team. And I thought, you know, obviously they've adjusted some stuff like major injuries. Like that's insane. Until I started looking at the coach report for the injured players. Duncan Watmore. Okay, he's not one of them. So I'm looking in this area for like he gets injured all the time, right? So Duncan Watmore is just bad luck. I, and it jumps down. That drives me crazy how stuff jumps around. Um, let's go Callan McManaman. Might have a problem with injuries. It's red. He's got a problem with injuries. If you go look at the injuries, it's like, yeah, yeah, 2016. Yeah, that's bad. And then, I mean, he's had four since we took over the club. Not good. And, and it's the same thing. Torn ankle ligaments. Like, they have coded Callum as, as an injury case. Lee Cattermole. Let's look. Fairly susceptible to injuries, right? So, whoops, sorry about that. And it's like, yeah, he's, yeah, yeah. And they're all, like, pretty significant injuries. Okay, whoop, right here. Um, do we do Dan Gibson? Could have real problems with injuries. <laughs> and he does. I hate to laugh. That's It's horrible to be laughing at that. But it's just like, oh, okay, yeah. Like, apparently... Sunderland, when they went to, to sign these guys, they didn't look at any of their history, right? Like, or maybe it was the, a, a value buy, right? Like, they, they they spent 500 grand on James Vaughn. But it's like, yeah, okay. So it, it makes sense. And maybe, I, I guess I, I was buying into the narrative that, you know, other people and other saves were running into the same thing. Um, and I get that you have to vary the training and all that. I do still think it's a little bit like if I put it on average training, I wish the game would just like manage the thing so that I'm not having to like rest everybody manually if I'm worried about injuries. But I think when you actually look at the club here, like, like everybody is sus like fairly susceptible to injuries. And that's, I mean, that's interesting, right? I don't know where it's getting that from him, but. It, it provides a little bit more context as to why there have been so many injuries with the club. So that's what's going on there. So let's get into episode eight now. But thanks, Max Dane, and all you guys in the comments. You're great. I freaking love you. Hey there. Welcome back. It's episode eight. It's weird to say welcome back since we just talked for a good bit. Anyway, um, we've won. We've won some games, people. We've won. We won three games. We're unbeaten in five. Okay. Really, when you, I mean, if we just start ignoring here, right? If you, if you look at our season, it's really not all that bad, right? We only have one, two, four losses. I know there's an easier way to see that. I wanted to count it right now. But, you know, like we haven't been smashing people aside from Bolton, but. You know, we have won some games, and we've drawn a bunch of games. So it's not nearly as bad as it seems. Like, I still think we should be more to the top than we are. But it's, you know, Wolves are currently, I want to say, top of the championship in real life. And it's about this time. I mean, I'm, you know, a little bit ahead, right? Um, I've officially lasted longer than, than what was it, Simon Gibson? Gibson and Gar Simon. Simon. What's, I, I'm looking it up on my browser. 
Grayson. Simon Grayson. I'm not going to cut that out. Why would I do that? So, we've got a game in hand. A draw here puts us into the promotion spot of a, a Birmingham. A win here gets us above Reading because Gold and Virgil. And if we really smash them, we could get us above Norch. Arr. So, right. We're at home. Um, the assistant manager is recommended we go control. That makes me nervous, but we're going to try it. Uh, I'm drinking some eggnog because I freaking love the stuff. So, our two strike partners up top. Williams right below that in the advanced playmaker role. Rudwell and Dadgummit, someone in the Discord told me how to say this guy. It's it's like Nudon. Nudon? He's, he's French. Right? He's Gabonese. Why did I think he was French? Anyway, I think it's Didier Ndon. We're going to go with that. I, I may just change his name to The Dong. We're, yeah, we're going to do that. I, I hope YouTube is okay with this. That just makes... That makes my life easier. The dung. Hopefully it's not offensive. If you think it's offensive, let me know in the comments. I'm just trying to make it easier to say in the game. Then we got uh, Gunnarsson in that ball winning with Fiddle. Oviedo, thank you for the pronunciation help in the comments. On that attacking wing back and Matthews. Because he quite likes it. And Oviedo's done a pretty good job. I believe. He says confidently. Yeah, 705. So our back line, uh, I'm going to say this, and then they're going to bomb. We're, our ratings are not all that bad. I mean, Rodwell, six goals, uh, blowing everybody's minds that is actually a Sunderland fan in real life. I've waffled on enough. I don't know why I just clicked that. Let's get into the game. We're going to try control. I feel like we should be doing counter because they're in fifth, but they're only three points ahead of us. So I think it actually does make sense maybe to not do that. Evens. Okay. I don't like, I don't like we're being favored. I don't know. It just seems to be not ideal. I do love this screen. I think this is the coolest thing. It's like we're at a real match. We're going to go auto. No, the last time I tried auto, I felt like it didn't actually do anything. So I'm going to come in here and at least manually set it. All right. Let's go passionate. Um, oh, that's not. I want something positive. Go out there and make sure that left has to no doubt as to why. All right, Kode is the only one who likes that. Right. Right. We're, they're still not feeling it from a, you know, team talk standpoint. Okay, well, they're playing They're playing a four... What is it? Four, one, two, three, DM wide. We're going to break them down, boys. We got the two strikers. Yeah. Okay, they've picked up an early yellow. Nice. On the, on the right? No, on our left there, right? Yep, yep, I knew that. Lots of nothing happening here. What's the analysis? What's your analysis? Okay, again, if you're going to tell me I should float crosses, pump the ball box, and hit early, I, I got to be able to get to the stats more easily. Like, I know you can click that, but, like, if it should be highlighted. I'm just saying, because then I have to come in here. Headers one seventy two 72%. I mean, it's early days. We'll try that, but it should be like right here. Or like, look at all this space. Like, maybe put it in this box. Just a suggestion. Well, we're going to see how it goes for like, I don't know, 30 minutes before we make any crazy changes. We'll be overrun in midfield. Okay. <laughs> what kind of a camera angle is that? We're struggling to get shots away. We have five shots. They have one. What are you talking about? Oh, goodness. Boy, that was... I, I just had to pause there. That that was amazing. We're going to show you just the free kick taker. We're not going to show you the wall. We're not even going to show you the goal. Don't worry. It's not going in anyway. All right. Headers one is... that. This is why you don't change things. Right? They're, they're right back to winning the headers. Okay. Um... You guys had said in the comments, if if you're if you're struggling, take work the ball in the box off. I apparently have nothing on. I didn't realize that. I I, I was hesitant to do that because like one of the the pre match tactical things like before it, like where you can give a talk about it the day before. Um, it was like 
we've missed every single shot outside of the penalty box. So, I, you know, just like, hey, uh, we should probably, you know, like, try that. Five shots, one on target. I mean, sure, we'll, we'll try it, I guess. Yeah, all, a bunch of shots outside the box. We'll try switching up. It's we got ten minutes until the half, so it's probably, you know, not gonna be that significant. Okay, seven shots, eight shots. Okay, okay, maybe maybe the game's on. Oh, they've got injuries. They've got injuries. What's wrong with him? Oh, he's got a groin. He's got a groin, lads. We'll see how they come out after the hat. We we may push that right side. Come on. Oh, there you go. You're on the right side. Do something. Pass. Pass. Rodwell, take a the, the dong. Kone. Oh, the center back. That was a pretty good shot. He was kind of slotting it towards the bottom corner there on the right side. Thought it was going in. Ooh. More. The dong. There he is. Rodwell. D d okay. D you have, like, three guys to pass to, and one of them is standing, like, literally on your heel. Like, spread out, guys. Don't let one guy <laughs> guard defend three of you. That seems... Unfortunate. Seems unfortunate. Um, all right. Passionately. Uh, duh, 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 duh. I'm happy with the performance so far. Keep it up. We're get <laughs> we're dominating the game. We just haven't put one in the back of the net. They all hate me. <laughs> what is the deal? What is the? Deal? What are you supposed to say? Like. You know, keep it up, but don't don't keep it up too hard. Oops, that was cheeky little passing there, little triangle action. McLean, oh, that's a great name. I've got a McLean. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, they're overloading the wing. They're overloading the wing. Oh, nice little pass, McLean. No one, no one's gonna run out there. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We've hit ten shots, five on target. That's why I'm. Up. I was trying to. Okay, we're gonna pause. Where? Where can I see their team? Please? Okay. Is it just the guy on the right? Yes. They subbed the other one. Potential thigh injury, but it's not too bad. But we could try and... We could try some stuff here. Okay. He's already getting close down, but we're going to... Okay. Switch it up. Switch it up. Confirm the changes, boys. Reuter. Doink. Oh, gets his head to it. The dunks. Oh, he's not going to be able to get to it. Passes it back. Applying that pressure to the center back. Okay. They're building from the back, people. Swiftly and cleanly with McLean. Gunter on the yellow. This this smells like a goal, doesn't it? They're just working their way down. He, I mean, I mean that was... Okay, hey! Their first on-target shot. We gotta get something going here. We have dominated the game. Possession-wise, not so much, but I'm not concerned about that because we got all the shots. And we have a clear-cut chance. Browning. Kone. Okay, to Matthews. Who's got down the wing? Down the wing, making a run is Grabin, who's goalless in like 900 games. But he's got an assist. Vaughn said, I'm not giving you a high-five, I'm running right past you. Like, see, mate, thanks for the pass. Come look at me. I really think the pass did it. Let's, let's see. I could be wrong. Maybe he slotted it in quite nicely, but I think the pass made that goal. Okay. I mean, it was 50-50. He had two defenders doing this, and he gets it top corner. Top, Ben. Oh, did the game just crash? Okay. Oh, I'm so nervous when it does. I just kind of, like, pauses. Like, uh, you guys okay? You, you doing all right back there? To the little dwarves inside the game engine. Are you okay? Nick the ball. Come on. Oh, no. They have lots, lots forward. Lot, lots. The sound just went out. They really wanted you to hear the whistle. They've not changed their formation. Oh, that was nervy. Right onto the penalty spot. What, what a clearance. What? What is with the camera angle? <laughs> Teleporting. Oh, they must have done an update or something. The game is acting all kinds of weird. That's hilarious. Here we go. Here we go. Do we need to do a time wasting sub? Matthews is on a 6.6. .6. Physicality is falling off. 6.5. Mm -hmm. Oh! 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 
Oh no, they have had all the shots. Oh, they went to a four-two-three-one. I did. See, I don't think that's fair. I didn't have a chance to react to that because, like, by the time you get to the maybe, maybe it's like on here. I should have. Maybe I probably should have noticed. I was looking at Matthew's rating. He's on a six-point-three. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. Do we change anything? I don't think we do. We've played well. I think we take Matthews out, though, because he's, he's... He's not done the job. Uh, we'll slide Browning over, and then that means we're going to bring in... Galloway, no, yes, no. Mark Wilson has a key player contract. I want to keep him happy. That's the dynamics coming into play. We'll go a little, how about we'll go flexible. Will that work for everybody? All right, let's go get them, boys. And then we may do something crazy in the last eight minutes. I'm going to call it eighth minute. We'll, we'll do a crazy sub. Okay. Oh, they're getting all the shots off. They want it, boys. Okay. Oviedo, just for measure, picks up. The Dong's not liking that we changed it. Browning is not happy we pushed him out. They're coming back into it. I'm, I'm, I feel like this may be a mistake, but we are going to get aggressive with the tactic. Um, by getting the wing backs up and maybe dropping Gunnarsson here. Except, no, we'll switch, we'll put Gunnarsson there, we'll put the Dong there, switch him around, and then, oh, okay, right. bring in, it seems foolish, right, like I'm bringing in an extra center back, but I, I think it's the right, I think it's the right, I'll put you on stopper, you on cover, and you on defend, and then you guys go attack on the wing, so we still have that defensive, you know, um, back line, but we have the wing backs giving us, you know, that attacking down the wing. We'll go ahead and say, look for the overlap. I'm tempted to try the underlap just because I've not done it before. Gunnarsson, what do you like to do? You like to do that too? What about Rodwell? You can do a, you know, we'll just switch them up. I don't know if that'll do it for us, but. Rodwell, I want to get Rodwell, I guess, closer into the box because he has scored six goals. So I know that's a long explanation. I'm just trying to talk myself through this. Um, go out there and make a difference, son. How about Galloway? Why don't you go get a an assist? That'd be nice, wouldn't it? I feel like I should have pushed the line up. But they do have, like, four in attacking roles, so maybe I shouldn't. The game is not doing anything. There it goes. We're going to get them on the break here, boys. We're going to let them hit the post. But, okay, Kona, you had all kinds of room. You had all kinds of room down the wing there. You could have dribbled and waited, held up the ball, instead of hoofing it just straight out of bounds. Okay, right. Nothing's happening. Um, right. You know what? I'm just going to leave it. I'm just going to leave it. We'll take a draw against fifth place, if that's what it takes. Disappointed I didn't see the formation change in time to do something because I, I would have probably pulled back into like a counter or you know dropped uh, our attacking midfielder back But you know, we'll take we'll take a draw. Well, that's that's, that's fair Gunnarsson with the 7.0 nice. I mean from a performance standpoint overall 13 shots six on target is pretty good I think for us um, You were unlucky today how are they feeling about that? Yeah, they're kind of feeling it. Everything's moving much slower, I guess, it, when they patch the they patch the game and put some stuff, you know, try and fix the bugs, I guess. But like this is moving really slow. It's lots of me talking and nothing happening, and then it jumps and it's like, yeah, here we go. So, okay. Um, we hold them to a draw. We, we were we were ahead. It's a positive uh, headline, so we're not complaining. Vaughn, nice. I mean, he's been a pretty good goal scorer. Grabbing, not doing really the job. He, he's not scored since 
what what how many games ago that was like 12 games ago back in september it is december 2nd okay so okay i'm used to the leagues i've played in have had winter breaks there's no winter break here so i'm gonna hop ahead several games um apparently we're in the fa cup so let's let's go find out we'll play barnsley we've already played barnsley haven't we Maybe we'll play, we'll figure out who the, the cup third round is. Again, I don't know if I can get two games done in one uh, episode. So we'll, we'll come back for the third, uh, the FA Cup third round. We'll figure out who that is. We'll play that game. And hopefully by then we're better in the table than we are right now. Currently, oh, we drew, yeah, right. They won. So I thought we were going to be at six, but, you know, somebody behind, below us won. So. We're in seventh place. We've we, we got a we're only nine points off the promotion spots. To be fair, but we got some stuff to do. So anyway, if you enjoyed that episode, smash a like on it. If you think my tactics are completely wrong, I'm open to hearing that as well. We'll see you in the comments. We'll see you in the next episode. You guys are awesome. We're over 600 subscribers. This is mind blowing. All right, we'll see you next time.